There's only one type of alligator out here? There's only one type, yes. Well, there's an invasive caiman, too. The speckled caiman. But it's not in here. Oh, no? Okay. Um, right. You'll find them down south. Oh, really? Like Homestead, in Homestead area? Homestead. Yeah. I find yeah. them a lot there. Yeah. All right. Here, you're only going to have American alligator. Yeah. There's only two species of alligators. There's the Chinese alligator that lives in Tokyo, Japan. Yep. They had them in the rice noodle diet right now. And the American alligator. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. As we're driving, just keep your eyes peeled. If you see anything, raise your hand. Yes, so if you run your hands this way, it will not cut you. If you run your hands the opposite way, it will. I just want to see it. Just be careful. There you now, go. Now, the Native Americans actually used to use this as a daily tool to cut their fish meat, their turtle meat, their fabrics on their clothes. That's crazy. Right. I didn't know that. The babies. And yes, it is extreme. I want to keep it. Really? <laughs> I've been cut already. I know it's. I've been sliced uh -huh. yeah. walk, walking through it. Oh, right here. But I did not know that. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, it'll slice you. Yeah. Not only that, this guy will save your life if you get stranded out here. Right. The sawgrass? Yes. Because you eat it? Yeah. The bottom, right? Yeah. So, this is one of the filtration systems out here. Right? So, if you get stranded out here, you chew on this. Chug on the water, this way you get your clean water. Not only that, you can eat this. First quarter, eight. Very tender. As you're going up, it gets very fibrous when you spare this. Okay? Yeah. All right, now in 30 minutes, your stomach's going to start hurting really, really bad. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was thinking about that. The bigger pieces have more. Yeah, more meat. More meat. Now, it doesn't have no nutritional value. It's just a filler, right? Oh, wow. This is not the plant you want to eat, but you get your water from it. This you'll survive off this. You will survive more you get off your the water? cattail. Off the cattail, right? Because it has a yeah, it has a, a thicker on the base. You water. can make uh, mashed potatoes, for bamboo shoots. You can even the flour. They make cattail kebabs out of the flour. Yeah, really. Yeah. I've never tried it. But. I've heard the same thing. The Everglades is full of food. Oh yeah, yeah. and medicine too. Yeah, like here we go. We got the. Where are we? That purple flower there, it's called the pickerel weed. Native Americans, the women of the tribe, used to make something that tastes like peanut butter out of this flower. Really? Not only that, they would decorate their homes with it. But if you eat the roots from it, it's like a natural Pepto-Bismol. Wow. It's good for the digestive system. Yeah. I'm going to show you guys a lot of cool things that Native Americans Yeah, yeah man, for sure. Look, awesome yeah. spider. If you guys look at this tree right here on your right, it's called Black Willow. Now, Native yeah. Americans will come to that tree to get rid of their pains by chewing on the bark or putting it into a tea and drinking. The tree contains salicylic acid, same compounds found in aspirin. Not all willow trees in the world contain that, not just the black one. All right, guys, so as we're driving through here, we're going to go pretty slow. That's the swamp so after, right? Yes. Oscar, the there's a spotted gar. Can yeah. you eat it? You can. The Native Americans would. It does not taste good at all. Right. Um, I guess about the size of a mango once ripe, completely brown. Disgusting. <laughs> so, now, Native Americans would call this the supermarket of the swamp. You can take off your earmuffs if you want. Look at this, this is cattail. 
Oh, this is the plan with the most benefits out here. Look at this. A lot of carbohydrates and the fruits. Can you eat it? Yes, you can. Not this part though, but the roots you can. So, you guys see the fibers inside? Yeah. All right. Yep. I'm sure you some pretty cool. What I'm going to do now is uh -huh. scrape it out. You guys seen this before? You've oh. used this before. It's in the medical field. What is oh, it? Wow. Gauze. Yep. It's gauze. Wow. This is actually better than the gauze you get in the store. It's has natural antiseptic. That is crazy. Let me see that. That is cool. Cool. Let me see that. Wrap up the wound that you got on that. Uh, yep. That little particle that design grass. are meant to clog up the heart. Uh. This plant actually even slows down your metabolism. This plant helps prevent cancer. Oh, uh, so regular diabetes, uh, and it's strong. Anemia. Look at this thing. You could literally wrap something with yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. Now, if oh, that's too big and say you get a big enough car and you're in pain and stuff, you will go between the leaves. At the base of the plant, there's a jelly. That jelly is an antiseptic and a pain reliever used to reduce inflammation in the skin. And it's like an anti itch. I use it all the time. I live in Chiquica National Park. Oh, okay. And, uh, you, where do you live? Chiquica National Park. Oh, no way. 168. Um, this stuff works better to me than Benadryl H cream and Calmy lotion and stuff. That's amazing. I believe that. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Not this one. I like that. There's other parts you can't. That part you can't. But some. Yeah, it does. Nice smell. Here, here, here. Bring it. I don't know. Look at all the Oscars here, ready to eat. That's Let's see if you come close. I know he's ready. My finger. Yeah. Wow. That's awesome. Did he pack you that? What'd you get? A bird? <laughs> That's what I got. Can I, can I see a piece? Okay. The same one. The only one. Okay. Daddy, did you see that? I said a bird. I remember there is a mother gator here. It hurts. Oh, yeah. Look, guys, it's one chicken. Look at that one. Let's see if we can get your fish. Elena, you're next. Just don't let the gators eat your fish. You gotta get them out quick. Just drop it. Just drop the rod. Alright, let it eat it. Let it eat it. Let it eat it. Let it drop it. Alright. See, I think you're on. Now. Nice. Look at that. Nice, Oscar. First guy, you want a fish? Yep. What'd you guys catch? 
The first of the mic. Look. Where's the gator? It just, she went down. She's going under the boat. No, she's not. She's no, let's not. see the Oscar. I want you to feed it. Anthony, show me the Oscar. It's black. With the red dot. No, you can't feed the alligator. Little teeth yet. here. Oh. Little teeth. Oh. Right. Throw it back. Yeah, watch the gators. All right, yeah, there you watch go. Your hand, watch your hand there. Yeah. All right, Elena, yeah. you catch one. All right, Elena, you got to get one. Yeah, I need a rod. Yep. <laughs> Elena wants to catch one. Let's do it. Yeah, it's her turn. Alright, All right, here we go. Uh -huh. Let's see a big uh no matter how many times Oscar. Look at that. There's a big Oscar. Oh, yeah, oh, let, 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 let him eat it. Let, let it go. Let, let him eat it. Just let it drop. Let him eat it. Yeah, when he eats it completely. Moving. Get him. Oh no, you gotta put it right in front of him. Drop it down, drop it down. Drop it down. No, just drop it your rod tip. He's gonna hit it. Right there, right there. Let it sink. You gotta let it sink. Get him, jerk. Oh, oh. You let it go. You gotta set the hook. It's hard. No, do it again. Do it again. It's a circle hook, so let it set hits. Is it a circle hook? Yeah. No, it's not. It's just a regular, it's like an owner. Uh, let him eat it. Let him eat it. All right. Oh. He's like spitting. The bird almost ate it. He's gonna get it. No, let him eat it. There you go. Let it fall. Let it fall. We want the big one to get it. There you go. Let him eat it. Let him eat it. Oh. <laughs> what in the world? Wait, wanna, All right. Here, I'll give you another bait. Watch out of the gator. Watch out of the gator. Here, I'll give you a new bait. Stupid gator! And then we'll switch on to this side again. Gator, move. Fish, fish thief you. is on this side now. All right, back up. She's going to come back see up, you. Back up. I'm going to pet her. She may want to join us on the boat. She smells that fish. That's what it is. She's like... Oh, no, let, let it eat, eat it. Let it eat it. Wait, yeah, you're on now. Oh, oh, wait, no, not anymore. Now, now you're on. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Alright. You got a bluegill, I think. Yeah. yeah. Bluegill. Yeah, shell crab. A good one. Okay. Good one. Be careful with those. You got it? I think yeah, they're I fighting. <laughs> my turn now. No, I want to poke the bird. Now it's my turn. No, is it a spotted sunfish? Yeah, it looks like it. It is a spotted sunfish. Look, Elena. This is actually a really cool sunfish. Look at this. It's my turn now. Eat this hook bird. Look, Elena, check this out. You've never caught one before. You want to hold it by the mouth? Wait, oh no, that's a new species for you. Wait, 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 wait. Look, new species. Yeah. He's on front. 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 No, throw it back. You can't feed gators. Why? We don't want them coming up to eat all our fish. Ooh. Oh, that was a good one, too. Yeah. All right, Bowen. This is it. Get that big Oscar. That's a nice one, man. That one. See that one just ate? That one right there? That's a good Oscar. I'm feeding the bird. Right. No, no, go put it in front of the Oscar, right there. Watch that gator, right? right the right gator is right. right. Oh yeah, a warm mouth ate it. Or a uh, sunfish. Uh, I think it's a yeah, I think it's yeah. a little sunfish. Here. Dang it, can I get can Look I try getting the Oscar again? Uh, Somebody else is up for the Oscar.
does mean it's a warning, meaning it's deadly. Correct. So yep. when he gets, when he feels threatened, he lift this little thing here like a stuff. Plus he's poisonous. And he tastes really bad. Exactly. Let me get a picture of you with him, Elaine. Hey, come back. Come back here. Oh my gosh, you're fast. There you go. Let me see. Video. Take a video. He's not going to start moving. Wait. So, all right, so the sawgrass, if you step on it and you walk through it, it will cut you. Yep. Right there. That's what I got. Me. Get off me. So, you Help. be extra careful, okay? Because you're. I haven't been through here in a while, so. Yeah, and there's a lot of sawgrass. A lot of snakes. I have to be but, extra careful, too. Let an adult get the snakes first. Gotta get you uh, an inside look at what these items are all about. What I found here is a pottery, right? Like a shell. Mm -hmm. uh, from when the Indians used to live on a these shell. islands. Mm -hmm. So the Indians always used to throw all the trash in one place. So what I guess is that the, this tree grew over it when it blew down. Now you can find everything. Find it. So found that is cool. In in all I see. I mean, I see pieces in there. Yeah, look right there. There's one. Could find a, that is a so cool. Head in here. Garbage? It is possible. But this is for sure, and it did used to live on these yeah. islands. Come on, let's go. Elena, this is awesome. You dig through it, you can actually find them. I see some more in here, yeah. Um, I found many okay. bones and stuff. I don't know what bones, but that could be really cool. Where's that? Where's that? Right, right. Where are we going to keep this bone? No, but if I need pottery, cool. Now, There's a bone. Do you why they call this the tourist tree? This is bone. I do. Yeah. Do you know? No. No. Because it looks like a tourist. No, man. Turns red and peels. Yes, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so when you feel it, the bark turns red. <laughs> okay. Just like a tourist that comes there. down uh, the you snowbirds. That, gumbo limbo. That's why I call it tourist tree, because you grab the layer on the top, skin peels, and bleed red. Okay, so that's, <laughs> uh, that's cool. I do see a few pieces of bone in here. No, yeah, there is. Mm -hmm. I don't really mess with it too much. Yeah. I want to like keep it. Right, what yeah, it is. A little, it's very cool. They only come in here in the winter. Because mm -hmm. in the summer, the yeah. mosquitoes will kill you. Exactly. Cool. Maybe it's a little wild. This concludes my video, and if you want to ever want to come to the Everglades, the link is in the description down below. And here's our captain, Captain Barry. I had a blast, and thanks for watching.